This would be one of your silly stories. What, you don't believe me? Well, how would you? You're an old man. Oh, old man, you cheeky minx. Well, if you did, why the post office? Look, if you really want to know, I'll tell you the whole story. Your Aunt Mavis and I were standing in the queue waiting for our pensions. It was taking ages. I bumped into an old pal of mine. Oh, morning, Bernie. Punch your day again, eh? Hiya, Jimmy. Place gets worse. Been here 20 minutes. I think it'd be quicker to rob the place. <laughs> You're probably right. <laughs> Which I thought was a joke at the time. I like the way this one thinks, <laughs> Bernie. <laughs> See you. Well, I remember your aunt Mavis seemed quite keen on the idea. Office. Don't be silly, babe. You got loopy in your old age. Well, I don't think it'd be that difficult. Not difficult? What do you mean, not difficult? It's not like shelling peas, you know. Put it this way I know what I'm doing. And I think Jimmy Anderson could help us out. What, Jimmy the Saint? So. You really want to see my collection? Well, that's what we're here for. Right then. What are you after? Sawn off shotgun? Samurai sword? Grenades? I'll tell you what. Seeing as you're friends of mine, I'll let you see my special merchandise. Two old coots like us do with all that money. Well, there's that bike your Lucy wants. And it's her birthday coming up soon. Oh, come off it, Maeve. I'm just going to get a vouchers. I mean, that's what grandparents do. I remember a Bernard Johnson. He would have jumped at the chance to do something like this 30 years ago. Think of all the things you've done in your life. Did you ever give them a second thought? They were for fun. Now you can do this for Lucy. Too hard for me. Hey. Well, I'm entitled to something. Oh, I see. Yes, yes, I see. There'd be enough for the bike and something for you. <laughs> I 
think we ought to go in. It's starting to snow. Can we stay out just for a bit? All right, go on. So why did Auntie Mavis want to do that? I don't know. I mean, she's, she's got some mad ideas. I'll tell you that for nothing. How did you do it, if you really did? Hey, I tried to tell you before, but you wouldn't believe me. I don't believe you. I just want to hear your story. Your stories are fun. <laughs> well, we certainly had fun. How's your mum? Oh, she came out of the hospital already. Yeah. She came out last week, so she's been ready for Friday. Oh, she's been looking out for her. Playing there. Yeah. Making her cups of tea and biscuits. Mm. Hey, I'm dying for a cup of tea and a biscuit. Yeah. We're doing me break soon, actually. No one to come here? No, there's no one. I'm here on my own today. All right, um, everybody, um, would, you, would you please get down? Uh, this, is a, this is a stick up. Okay, everyone, get out now. Come on, you better do what she says. Get out. Where did you get to? Never mind that. 
Where's my share of the lolly? Bye. 